Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Fallout 4, this is the series, um, this is where we left off, as you can see we killed Kellogg, um, it was unexpected, because, oh god, I'm sorry, it was, it was just hilarious what happened last time, it's like, we, we killed him in like two shots, and it's like, oh god, it, it was just brilliant, I'm sorry. Uh, I, I, I just, it was it was a very funny episode. If you haven't already seen it, I'll leave the link in the description below. So if you want to check it out, um, be sure to check it out because it, it was. Oh god, I can't even say, dude. It was that funny. <laughs> well, I don't know if it was funny, but it, it it was funny to me. It was. I also hope you guys enjoy the video I uploaded two days ago, which was the. GTA 5 video, um, I had fun doing it, I'm probably going to do some more challenges, like playing online with like other people and just driving a... No, how, how are you not dead? Come on, come on. Damn you sent get out of here. There we go. Yeah, what was I saying? I, th I think I'm going to leave it for now. <laughs> I'll just play this game for now. So, uh, yeah, hope you guys are having a brilliant fr Friday morning, if not, um, just want to say, hope you have a better day today by watching this video and hopefully I'll make you laugh in the video or make you smile at least because that that's what I tried to do I um, tried to make people like smile like that but uh, I know I made uh, Falcon not Falcon, it's not, it's not, no, it's not Falcon is it? it's uh, Eagle um, he's been helping out a lot recently in the streams so I want to say thank you buddy and also he has, got, he has now got moderator in the stream because we hit 1550 um, the other day, so I want to say thank you to everyone that helped me hit it. I, I can't s thank you guys enough. I have no clue where we're going. Uh, this way. Apparently we have to go here, but how do we open it? Oh, right, I get it. We actually have to go back and open the open it by a thing. Okay, right. It's understandable now. Alright, let's go back. So, uh, yeah, it's just, I have to admit, I've, I'm having a fun week at the moment. Hope you guys are as well. As you can tell, I'm trying to stream more often now, because um, I have nothing really to do. So, yes, yeah, it, it is fun. I'm having f fun doing the stream. It's like when we did the Fallout 4 stream the other day. It was brilliant. I can't thank you guys enough for that stream. Like, um, you guys joining like that. I can't thank you enough. Alright, let's go in here. Let's go in here and find out what the hell we have to do. I think we actually have to use one of these computers. It's been forever since I've ever done this mission, so... <laughs> yeah, uh, doesn't seem to be anything here, but I'll take all that. Uh, is there a computer here? Let's try that. Aha, security door control. Open door. There we go. That should have opened it if I'm correct. Yes, it is. Let's try to open, there we go. Oh, I open this one as well. <laughs> oh, okay, so we don't have to walk all the way back, which I'm happy about. Oh, here we go. But yeah, I do apologise for some of the lag in the stream the other day. <laughs> also, I might be having a Mice in my car video coming out. Um, because we've actually got the car working. Still can't find the toolbox. The toolbox has gone missing, so I can't fix the car. <laughs> um, so yeah, I, I, tr I try and figure out something. <laughs> yeah. Right, here you go. Come on, Nick Valentine, what are you doing, buddy? Right, I don't actually know where we have to go after this. Let's have a quick look on our pit boy. Oh, I'll have some, I'll have some snail bits. Whatever, oh, screw bits, not snail. <laughs> Let's give you your findings with Pepper, okay. There we go. Oh, it's this way. I was wondering which way do we go? It's like, oh, okay, it's this way. <laughs> Uh, huh. Right, let's see if we can open this. If not, I'll get Nick Valentine to open it. Whoa, open doors. Oh, screw it. There's bloody turrets behind there, isn't it? Oh no, I already blew them all up. Okay. I was wondering if I didn't blow them all up. Whoops. And I do realise I have left my mods on, so this has kind of ruined my theories, but I'm going to try and turn them off. As soon as I can, I do apologise. I do like the music though, it's... Fallout 4 music is brilliant. Like the soundtrack. Because I remember doing a video on it ages ago about the... Like the theme, like the start of the game. Where it's just a... Mainly the home screen. And I did that and it 
got quite a few views. I want to say thank you guys for that. That was quite a while ago, back in 2016, if I'm correct. Investigate the Brotherhood. Eh? What the fudge is that? Jeez, dude. I haven't even gone to the Brotherhood yet. And why is it already here? I thought if I would go... Eh? That got here quickly. I am not, I'm not even part of the Brotherhood. I haven't even talked to anyone in the Brotherhood yet. Wow. Just, wow. Right, I'm going to see if we can fast travel to our location. Yep, time to see. Might as well fast travel. But hey, I guess I can go and check it out. Whenever. <laughs> I think what we'll do is check it out after this. we've done this, but I'm not too sure yet. Because, like I said, this series is mainly on about missions and uh, stuff like that. So, yeah, like I said, we'll, we'll have to figure out something and go from there. But I think what I'll do from now on is just get a timer up so I know how long I've been recording for. Because I have no clue. I just try and work it out in my head. So... Why are we left alone? Hey, what's wrong? Listen to Valentine's distress. Oh, I was gonna say, why do you want to let me? I, I, I didn't even do anything. I, I, I just spawned in, and she goes, "I just want to be left out." I, I didn't even say anything to you. <laughs> oh God. Wait, what's up, Piper? What's the story? What's the story? Uh, do, 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 do. Where to begin? Oh, we'll help, just... Piper. This man named Kellogg kidnapped my son. That was all. He was working with the Institute. He... He gave him Sean. The Institute. Oh, boy. Well, good luck trying to get in there. I've been investigating these creeps for over a year now. Also, I do apologize if you guys hear my fan in the background. It's because it's very hot in the UK at the moment. It's like 24, 22 degrees, and it's like I've got my window open and my fan opens so it. My fan open? I mean, my fan on, so yeah, I do apologize if you do hear it. I know how to get in. Just teleport in. Like, just use a mod where you can just ghost through it. <laughs> Because he's dead. He's dead. So, a um, murderer and a kidnapper gets his brain blown out. Huh. Be a great ending if he didn't still have the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth to solve. Well, my fault. He, 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 started, he started it. <laughs> it wasn't his talk. Even if I had a way of bringing him in alive. Gets his brain blown out. Huh. You know. May not need the man at all. You're talking crazy here, Nick. Got a fall from the old subroutines? Look, there's a place in good neighbor called the memory den. Oh yeah, I mean it's bit. the past moments in your mind as clear as the day they the mind behind the memories. Right, good idea. Let's see. No, you just didn't look, Nick. I know it's grisly, but what choice do we have? We got no lead, nothing. That old Merc's brain just might have all the secrets we need to know. Actually, I already have something because I picked someone up when I was there. Kellogg had this thing attached to his head. Cybernetics, huh? We may have just won the lottery. The lottery? Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, barely you can win the lottery. I have to go to the memory den either way. I'm going to introduce you to Amari. If you want to head there together, just say so. 
I guess we could take Piper. We'll meet you there. Sounds good. You two stay out of trouble. Don't worry. We're gonna get the boy back. Two more steps. Because we can either go with the Brotherhood to get into the Institute, uh, the Railroad, or uh, the Minutemen. But I, I don't know if you can get into the into the Institute with the Minutemen. I've never actually tried it. Oh, come on, uh, Piper, let's go. Yeah, I'm not... To be honest, I'm not sure. Right. What missions do we actually have to do then? So we've got talk to... Okay, um... If we just travel... Fast travel to Parkway Station. That's weird, because... I, I just don't know if you can actually get into the Institute with the Minimum. I think what I'll have to do after I've done this video is look it up and see if we can. Because if we can, I'm going with the Minutemen, because I kind of betrayed the Minutemen because of the Nuke Cola. Or Nuke. Nuke. Nuke World, or whatever you want to call it. Nuke Cola World, that's one. But, um, I think what I want to do is leave the Nuke Cola out of this one for now, because it's just going to ruin the series. So, I do apologise, and I might leave Par or Far Harbour out. I'm not too sure. I'll have to think about that. Because what we're doing now is just doing stuff around for the Commonwealth. But then if I probably do another series, it, it will just be about Far Harbour. Far Harbour or is it Par Harbour? I have no clue. I can't remember. I do apologise. Ah, it is a very nice day out today. If you guys are wondering, I'm actually recording this on a Thursday, so it'll be up tomorrow. But yeah, today for you guys. Yeah, my recording schedule is really weird, so I I do apologise. Right, where do we go? Apparently, we're going nowhere. I guess we'll go this way. Screw that! I ain't attacking that. No, no, no way. Not today. Mm -mm. Oh my god! Really? Come on. Oh god, they're like... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Might as well shoot it while we're here. Oh my god, we blimped smithereens. Run. Run for your lives. <coughs> right, can we... I'm not too sure how we can get in. Oh god, no. Not, it's not stupid mutants. Aha, there it is. But how do we get in there? You hear nothing. You may be good for. Oh, come on. How did that not kill him? Run, run, away. run away, run away. Do, 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 do. Ah, the lag. I do apologize. I, I know I keep saying. Oh, God. Someone killed that moron. Right, so it's literally right there, but I don't know how we can get in. I guess we have to go all the way around. I'm not too sure. I forget how to get in myself. I've been trying to figure out. Since I've ever played this game. It's like when I've uh, had my other save. So my one that I completed the game with. It's like, how do I get in here again? It's like, oh, uh, right, it's there. You stand back to heal them. To heal me or what? Didn't want to use that one, but okay. But I have to admit, Jet is fun to use. Just for slow motion wise. Blow his head off. Hey! Hey, don't swear. This must be a family friendly content. Family friendly? Oh, what am I saying? Oh, no. I bet you just stand back then. There we go. There we go. We're now healed. Healed. Um, right. So it's just around here. So shit, I could have gone this way then. Ah, uh, the lag. Why lag? Come on. I'm playing on PS4. What was that? Oh, no, mate. Grenades. That's what, that's what it is. Yes. Yeah, so, he's like, someone there. It's like, no, it's just my grenade. Grenade! Oh, there we go. Let's go in here. And go from there. Ah! 
Ah, I think what I'll do guys is do this bit of the mission and I'll end it because like I say I'm not too sure how long I've been recording for it's kind of a pain because my Fallout 4 series is meant to be a good half an hour long but like I say I don't know how long I've been recording for so like I say I do apologize hey hold up there first time in good neighbor you can't go walking around without insurance Insurance? insurance? That's right. Insurance. Personal protection. You hand over everything you got in their pockets, or accidents start happening to you. Be bloody accident. Hey, it's Hank York. <laughs> hey, man. What do you care? Oh, Nick Valentine's here as well. Letting outsiders walk all over us. One day, there'll be a new man. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. Let me tell you something. Uh oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait. My heart over here. You alright, brother? Yeah, oh yeah, I'm good, thanks, mate. I'm good. I'm good. You just murdered someone right in front of me. Now don't let this insult your good neighbors of the people before the people. You feel me? Yeah. Uh, I, 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 I'm just gonna like walk away from what he's just done. So long as you. Who's in charge? Yeah, of course I do. All right, let's go. Let's go over to the memory den. I don't know why. I never liked this part of the mission. I don't know why. Not too sure. I think we've either been a good. Oh, hello. Nick's in love. Well, I figured out a title now. <laughs> Nick. Nick in love? Or Nick Valentine in love? Or Valentine in love? I don't know. Dr. Amari? Yes. I take it this isn't a social. Uh, we need help, Doctor. I need the memories from a man named Kellogg. But he's dead. I know it's asking for the mirror. Alright, that took his time. <laughs> Just, yeah. Are you doing that? Putting aside the fact that you're asking me to defy the corpse. You don't realize that the memory simulators require intact, living brains to function. Please. Detail us. Nick told me you're the only one who can make this work. This dead brain had inside knowledge of the Institute, Amari. The biggest scientific secret of the Commonwealth. You need this. And so do we. Fine. I'll take a look. But no guarantees. Do you have it with you? Uh, here Here's it is. What I could find. What's this? This isn't a brain. This is... Wait. That's the hippocampus. And this thing attached to it? A neural interface? Mm, the circuits look awfully familiar. I'm not surprised. From what I've seen, all Institute technology has a similar architecture. Hmm. Guess that one. Mr. Valentine is an older generation cynic. But Institute technology being what it is, the brain implant will fit him. <gasps> Nick! You need to do this now! <laughs> We're talking about wiring something to his brain. Don't worry about me, Amari. I'm well past the warranty date anyway. Thanks, Nick. Thank you. Right. Do this. Just sit If I start cackling like an old grizzled mercenary, pull me out, okay? Oh, okay, we have to wait for we have to wait for it to put it in, okay. Let's see here. Talking to me, Mr. Valentine. Any slight change in your cognitive functions could be bad. Are you feeling any different? A lot of flashes. Static. I can't make sense of any of it, Doc. That's what I was afraid of. The mnemonic impressions are encoded. It appears the Institute has one last fail set. There's a lock on the memories in the impact. 
Hey. Tell me you have a way past this stuff. Let me think. The encryption is too strong for a single mind. But what if we used to reload both you and Mr. Valentine into the memory line? Run your cognitive functions in parallel. He'll act as a host while your consciousness drives through whatever memories we can. Mm -hmm. Let's do this then, alright, come on then. Let's Might as well do it. Just sit down over there. Uh -huh. Right, uh, which one do we sit in? Uh, we sit in this one, okay. Why couldn't think Valentine sit in this one? It's like he was right next to it. <laughs> right, here we go. Please stand by. Of course, like what they did on the TVs. Um, when the nuke went off on this game. Just hold on. Okay. Here we go. Time to find what he did to my son. AKA Sean. <laughs> um, right, here we go. Don't please. Don't. Is it frozen? I was gonna say, please don't say it's frozen because we're doing so good here. Oh, hello. The simulation appears to be working, although the memories are quite fragmentary. I'll try to step you through the intact memories and hope we find one that gives us some clue to the Institute's location. Uh, where do we go to? There. This one? This is the earliest intact memory I can find. Well, oh, which one? This one? Um, I, I don't know where. Eh, eh. Oh, right. Oh, right. Okay, I understand it now. Whoops. <laughs> My bad. Like I said, it's been forever since I've ever done these missions. You are experiencing these memories as Kellogg. This may prove disorienting at first. Session. Mom knew how it was. She wasn't soft, but she loved me in her way. Oh, so that's not Sean, that's that's that's, that's Kellogg. <laughs> that cost her more than a few beatings. I was such a dummy back then. What did I know about how the world worked? I think now she wanted me to kill him. I should have. Instead, I ended up running away. I told myself I wanted to find somewhere out from under the thumb of the NCR and all their rules. But really, I was running from the guilt of not protecting her from Dad. Yeah, it doesn't matter now, though. Oh, that's mean. I just could see what he does. Dad was either drunk or not around. I guess he must have run with one of the Raider gangs, but I never really knew what he did. Don't know why Mom was with him. Maybe at some point in his life he wasn't a complete asshole. Mm. It's just like Sister Radio. People are always hoping for something better. They usually end up with something worse. Let's go up here then. This doesn't seem to be what they're looking for. No, we're trying to find Sean, not buddy his past. <laughs> intact memory close to you in temporal secrets. There. Oh, hello, what's this? Wait, is that who I think it is? Are you? You'll see. But we don't know anybody here. And now with the baby? Come on, Sarah, you gotta get a chance. I finally got steady work with a good outfit. Nothing like that in the Wow, look how like that he looks different when he was younger. I'm not saying this was a mistake, eh? I'm just Are you sure these guys know what they're doing? They seem kind of Green. I know. But that's where I come in. Just wait. In a few years, I'll be running my own crew. As soon as I make the connections, I can. Then I can give you anything you want. A little Mary, too. So we had a kid? Must be my mama instincts kicking in. I know I had those, huh? Come on. You're great with her. And you don't need to worry about me. Most of it's just running security for the sheep. Bob's standing around looking tough. Well, 
They sure picked the right person for that job. Listen, it's gonna be great here. So, you, see this? What? This is what's gonna keep you and Mary safe. I promise. I was gonna say, was you gonna shoot her then? I what know. the? I'm sure we're gonna be really happy here. We are. You'll see. It's okay. I got it. Wait. That looked like they were living in, um... It looks like they're in, uh... Ah, uh, San Francisco. Because of the bridge. The red bridge. It looked the same. So you came very far away then. Uh, I know where we are. How did you think this was going to end, Kellogg? <laughs> you thought you could just fuck with us, and we wouldn't fuck with you? Just so you know... Isn't this where we killed him? We died like dogs. And you weren't there to help them. To I'll connect you. Okay then. Well, let's go and find what we need then. So we're going from his past to when he was getting older. Oh, okay. I gotta say, they have done a very good job to this game. Mind if we sit down? Suit yourself. So, um, I hear you take care of people's arms. Is that what If you pay me. Oh, we'll pay you. And uh, you'll do this all by yourself. That's right. We pay you when the job's done. Is that okay? That's the way you want to do it. So why actually have... Uh... Well, it's like... There's this fan who lives down the creek. Well, we seem to be getting closer. Try hmm. this next one. Okay. Ah, uh, so I think this is where they come and get us. Like, not, not us, but you know, Sean. Like when they steal him from the vault. Because that seems to me, does that look, does that look like the vault? I think? No, it's not. That's it. Mr. Keller, I'm glad you decided to meet with me. So, you're with the Institute. Oh, no, it's Institute. <laughs> I wanted to see for myself if you really existed. We do, as you can see. What do you want? It's come to my attention that you've been rather disruptive of our operations. This must stop. I do what people pay me to do. If that's a problem for you, I can see only one way out. And what's that, Mr. Kellogg? If I'm working for you, there's no more problem. From what I hear, you can afford me. Well, I then. I think you fully understand the situation you're in. I think I do. Very well. B748, initiate. Well, they, they were pretty crap, uh, um, robots then. Hmm. Impressive. We may have something to talk about after all. Mm -hmm. If you want, one of these has got to tell us something. Look, you can see all the memories, look. That's awesome. There's one that looks mostly intact. Connecting now. Here it is. This is the bit. Manual override initiated. Cryogenic stasis suspended. Vault computers are still working. That's good. Checking through the logs. Hopefully it's all... Just... Find it. Pod C6. Down the hall near the end. So wait, they was they were alive. They were alive. I never knew why we didn't just refreeze the rest of them. But we had our orders. Guess the old man didn't want so many loose ends. So these were got these guys everyone in here was actually alive then. But why didn't they come out as well then? 
That is really weird. So if they were alone, I'm com that is very confusing because look, they are trying to get out. There's me. Is it over? Are we okay? Almost. Everything's going to be fine. Access backup memory. Even there, I knew it was a mistake leaving him alive. I understood, I understood what kind of, kind of revenge. revenge. No, no one. one better. But I was cocky enough to assume I could handle some soft pre-war vault dweller, even if he somehow got thawed out. At least I know those institute bastards will soon get what's coming to them too. I want to know why these guys out. didn't come out then if they were alive they as well. That is, that is very long. confusing. Get the kid out of here and let's go. At least we still have the backup. Right, let's talk. Let's see what access his memory is taking. The institute's main operator in the Commonwealth. If they needed something done. They came to me. It wasn't usual for anybody from the institute to come along on a mission, so this one stood out. I didn't know then who it was we were grabbing from the vault. Of course. Neither did they. Not really. I'm just very confused why these guys didn't come out as well then, if they were alive. Oh right, so they refreeze them. I'm almost finished, Kellogg. I just need to confirm. Alright, we're good. I'm uh Oh, so they get refrozen again. Okay. I found another intact memory. Whenever you're ready. So this is where we actually see Sean then. This is where this is in the Diamond this is in Diamond City. Is that your son? This appears to be a very recent memory. So good news. Recent? But eh? wasn't my idea to settle down with the kid in the middle of Diamond City. <laughs> I thought it was a terrible idea, actually. But it was one of the old man's pet projects, so here we were. Me and the kid. Like a happy little family. I ended up kind of liking it. A reminder of what my life might have been if things had turned out differently. So what happened to his I wife and kid then? Back. I knew it was just temporary. It'd be back to normal business before too long. So where do I go now then? No, oh, it seems to be another memory. Oh no, this is the memory we're just in. Okay. This whole setup in Diamond City was part of some elaborate plan of the old man's. Who's the old man? It seems obvious now that we were bait for our friend from the vault. Timing couldn't have been an accident. It's not how the old man works. Who the hell is this guy? He outsmarted me in the end. Another loose end tied up. So who, who is this guy? Oh. It's okay. One of these days you're going to get your head blown. Barging in here like that. Minimizing my exposure to civilians is a priority. Forget I said anything. So what's the mm. crisis this time? New orders for you. One of our scientists has left the institute. Left? As in? He's gone rogue. Name's Dr. Brian Virgin. We know he's hiding somewhere in the glowing sea. Here's his file. So that's the file that we found on the desk then. Capture and return or just elimination? Elimination. He was working on a highly classified program. No kidding. One of the top bioscience boys? Damn. 
So, I guess you're taking the kid back with you. Affirmative. Your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil. You're taking me home with my father? Yes. Stand next to me and hold still. Okay. But I'm your son. I'm not your son. I'm your dad. Oh, God. There he goes. So where do we go now? Teleportation. Now it all makes sense. Nobody's found the entrance to the institute because there is no entrance. It's just a teleportation. Let me pull you out of there as soon as you're ready. I'm ready, but how do I get out of here? All right. Well, that was very intense. That actually was. Oh, I, I feel great. <laughs> yeah. It's like, yeah, I'm, I'm great, mate. I'm good. Uh, that was brilliant, though, guys. That was brilliant. The Institute used a teleportation to get in and out. Virgil. That scientist Kellogg was supposed to track down. Virgil, we need to find him. So I think we'll find him in the next episode. I think. The glowing sea. I'll find him. If we need to find Virgil, then I'm going after him. If you're going to go, be prepared. You'll need some way to combat the radiation. It's called the glowing sea. I'll find a way. I'll find a way to get through the rats. Don't worry. Good luck. And be safe. By the way, I unplugged Mr. Valentine first. Remove the implant while you were waking up. He's waiting for you upstairs. Let's go and see how he did and go from there. Oh, that was brilliant though, guys. That was... That was brilliant when you fit level 10. Level 11, sorry. Alright, let's go and see how he is. Hey, Hello. Valentine. What the hell? <laughs> that was right. I should have killed you when you were on ice. Kellogg? Is that you? What? What are you talking about? You sounded like Kellogg. Kellogg just then. Did I? Mark said there might be some mnemonic impressions left over. Anyway, I feel fine, so let's get going. Ah, <sighs> well then. Back to Diamond City. I'll keep Piper. Good luck out there. You know where to find me. Well, guys, I want to say thank you all for watching. If you did like this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new. Links in the description below my Twitter. Please follow me on there if you haven't already. And if we say hit 10 likes on this video, I'll get. Sh I'll be sure to upload the another another part of this video. Say around Monday or Sunday, because I have nothing ready for Sunday. So, yeah, I want to say thank you for watching and take care.